Hello my friends, in today's video I am going to show you how you can easily design a PCB. PCB stands for printed circuit board. So to design PCB we need some software where we can design our PCB. For this purpose there are so many paid as well as free tools are available on internet. But my favorite one is Easy EDA. Why I like Easy EDA? because it's really very simple to use for a beginner as well as for a professional user. Also, Easy EDA have a huge collection of parts library inbuilt and lots of readily available circuit contributed by different users. And yes, Easy EDA is 100% free, anyone can use it. So without wasting any time, let's get quickly dive into the Easy EDA software. Now you have a chance to get $10 coupon for free. Just design PCB in Easy EDA and order it from JLC PCB. I request you all to join Easy EDA JLC PCB Electronics for more benefits. Easy EDA is a web based PCB designing tool, but you can also download its desktop version. Simply type Easy EDA in Google and open the first link. So now we are on the home page and you have to do a registration from here. Either you can use your Google account or you can create a username and password. I am going to log in with my Google account. After successful logging in, go to the Easy EDA Designer option on the top right corner of the screen. Now this is our PCB designing user interface. So first we have to create a project. For that you have to go File, New and click on the project. Now you can give any appropriate name to the project and description if you want to and then click on save. Ok, now finally we have this sheet with the title block. On this sheet we have to draw schematic for the PCB. But wait, in this demo video I am going to make a Arduino PCB on which we can connect two DC motors, one stepper motor, one Bluetooth module and one I2C module. Now first of all we need some components to start circuit drawing. So to get the parts, go to the library and type the component name which you want. Place all the required parts one by one in the drawing area. Sometimes we are confused about footprint of the parts, like whether the selected symbol in design will match with the actual component or not. To cross verify this, I have a very simple solution for that. Go to the PCB view of the component. Now go to the view option and go to the zoom and select 100%. Now simply place your component on the screen and check whether it is matching or not. If it is matching then you can go with the selected part. Now we have our parts in a drawing area. We can now start connection. But wait, many of us even previously I also used to draw schematic like this selecting components and start to draw connection lines uh, like this but wait you don't have to do like this it's not a good practice to draw schematic for pcb like this this will make the schematic diagram very very complex to understand what you have to do is first of all divide the pcb components in different circuits like pcb power circuit dc motor circuit stepper motor circuit servo motor circuit analog input circuit encoder circuit and etc etc This wire tool is used to make connection between components. Here I prepared circuit in a small small group. First I will prepare circuit for a voltage regulator. Wherever in the circuit need 9 volt or a 12 volt we just need to indicate this NAT port. That's it, no need to draw whole connection lines. First I completed the ground and power connection to all the parts of the circuit. Then I connect digital pins of Arduino with the driver IC by using NAT port. Just give same name to the port on the both ends. By using NAT port connection method our circuit diagram is very neat and clean and easy to understand. In this way our PCB schematic is completed now we are ready to convert it into the PCB. To convert drawing into PCB go to the design tab and click on convert schematic to PCB. It will ask you to check nets or continue without checking nets. If you need to check nets then click on yes or you can continue with no keep going. Now the new PCB window will open. From here you can set the unit of measurements. We are keeping it mm. Number of layers of PCB. We want two layer of PCB so we are keeping it two. You can select the shape of PCB from here. We will go with the rectangular PCB. 
here you can set the origin coordinates of pcb we are also keeping it as it is from here you can enter the size of pcb we are also keeping it as it is and now click on apply now you have a pcb window open we have to design our pcb here now drag and place the components in the pink border that is our pcb outline PCB component arrangement is done. Our PCB now looks something like this. Now we have to do routing for the trace. So please go to the route option. Click on the auto router. Here you can manage some routing settings like trace width, clearance between traces, wire diameter, wire drill diameter, etc. And now here is a one of the best feature of Easy EDA that is local auto router. You can download it by clicking here. After complete download, open the folder and launch this file and keep it running in background now come back to easy eda and select the local router and click on run now magically routing will done automatically in few seconds our pcb is now almost ready now in the last we have to add copper area at the top and the bottom layer of the pcb first of all keep the top layer selected and select the copper area tools we need copper layer for ground net so keep ground selected and click on ok now draw a box around the pcb and do right click after that copper layer is added now do the same process for the bottom layer also you can also visualize pcb in 3d view now our PCB is ready to order. You can directly order PCB from EasyEDA to GLCPCB.com. To order PCB, go to the fabrication option, click on PCB fabrication file, click on yes, check DRC. If everything is fine, a new window will pop up. Now at bottom right corner, either you can generate Gerber file or you directly order PCB from GLCPCB. I am going to order it from GLCPCB. Then click on OK. You will redirect to GLC PCB website. Here your GOBA file is automatically loaded in system. You select PCB quantity, PCB colors from these options. And then click on save to cart. Then click on checkout. Now here you have to enter your name and shipping address and select the shipping method. Now click on submit order and proceed for the payment. After successful payment, you will receive your quality PCB in very short time. GLC PCB have a very fast 24 hour PCB production time.